kwanza matatizo la kwanza kukosa uraia unanifanya mimi ninakosa haki zote za msingi kwa vile jambo hili linatuumiza sana linatutea unyonge kabisa tunadharauliwa kabisa hatuna thamani kwa wenzetu millions of people around the world are stateless many are in the great lakes region ukosefu kitambulisho umefanya mtu upati usafiri upati kazi wataka upate basi certificate upati hati ya ndoa pia uwezi kupata stateless persons belong nowhere they can't send their children to school access healthcare systems or own land they risk exploitation or even trafficking access to rights and services depends on one's nationality it is the right to have rights stateless persons are therefore amongst the most marginalized groups in society today une personne sans patrie c'est une personne qui n'a pas uh, de droits fondamentaux they don't uh, participate in the economy because they don't have documents you're talking about people who don't have rights who don't have all the basic rights that we take for granted even your neighbor can be a stateless person but you don't know so we need to inform people about this situation there are people who exist but at the same time are invisible statelessness can arise due to gaps in nationality laws a lack of documentation migratory factors or changes in borders vous n'êtes pas sans ignorer que la RCA depuis quelques décennies est un pays qui a connu beaucoup de crises qui ont laissé des orphelins des enfants qui ici demain ne seront pas dans la possibilité de justifier leur appartenance à l'état sud-africain exclusion poses real risks to development peace and security this has led the international conference on the great lakes region and unhcr to take action alors on peut pas avoir une région avec des apatrides dès lors qu'on sait que euh, nous venons de loin nous sommes une région qui a été euh, longtemps secouée par les conflits et il est important pour nous de lutter contre l'apatride pour que la région puisse effectivement continuer à travailler dans le sens de la consolidation de la paix et de la stabilité. In October 2017, the countries of the Great Lakes region came together in Brazzaville to reaffirm their commitment to ending statelessness by 2024. La patrie est un phénomène réel. Réel, c'est-à-dire qui existe en Asie. The Brazzaville Declaration and Action Plan set out a roadmap for countries to identify and protect stateless persons, reform laws and policies, and improve civil registration systems. Let's have populations that can be identified as opposed to people in your midis who are already there anyway but don't have any form of documentation to identify them. The 12 countries now have official focal points on statelessness. They gathered in Naivasha in April 2018 and committed to setting up a task force, developing a national action plan, and triggering the ratification of the international legal instruments on statelessness. We discuss here the, how to operationalize the plan of action. Uh, we discuss the need for a national plan of action and we discuss also the term of reference of the focal points so now the whole issue is how to put all this together and to start implementing uh, the plan of action how to eradicate statelessness in countries of course we've already acceded to the 1954 convention and we have a task of acceding to the 1961 which essentially asks for reduction on statelessness so for us going forward with the Brazzaville uh, declaration it's about putting the commitments that we signed up to into action d'abord d'abord on a appris beaucoup de choses surtout les partages et d'expériences avec les collègues des autres pays ça ça nous intéresse surtout nos amis des pays anglophones ça ça nous intéresse plus hein? already the region is on the move 
ending generations of suffering, the Makonde, a formerly stateless population, were finally recognized in 2016 as the 43rd tribe of Kenya. So we have already um, moved on, identified and uh, registered the Makonde people to become Kenyans. We have identified groups like the Pemba and other smaller groups which the task force will identify and assist in registering so that we achieve the common goal towards uh, eradicating statelessness. Nilipofika hapa nyumbani niliwaambia watoto wangu chinjeni jogo. Nilichinja kuku hapa na pilau nyingi sana nikala na watoto wangu. Kwa kweli toka nimepata kitambulisho maisha yangu yamebadilika. Mimi nilijikuta kambe nimezaliwa tena upya. It is now up to all of us to end statelessness so that stateless people can come out of the shadows, be recognized as citizens, and help build prosperous and stable societies throughout the Great Lakes region. When we go back home, we will mobilize stakeholders so as to maximize the benefit from this declaration and make it applied in Sudan. Nothing is going to be an obstacle to Southern Sudan also of solving the problem or eradication of resistances. Basic life and dignity come with nationality, so I think it's very, very, very important to eradicate the business.